here, young lady. And why have you got Joseph's mobile phone? Honestly, it's all right, Joseph. I'll bring it over in a minute. You are too naughty. Yes, I'm talking to you. What are you like? Hi, everyone. I hope you're all okay today. And if you're not feeling well, I hope you feel better very soon. I've got my gorgeous Francis with me today and we're going to do something a little bit different. Yes I know. Joseph hang on. I've just got to give Joseph his mobile. There you go you can call Kai. Honestly that boy in his mobile. Um, don't take his mobile. Cheeky little devil. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, I'm going to do a twinning video today with my dear friend Gail from Susie Q's Happy Haven. And I know she hasn't got this sculpt, but I'm going to twin with an outfit. Now this outfit, I sent the male version to Liam. And it's this lovely mustard colour and it's got black dragonflies on it. There's a little bit of smocking at the top on this one, a little frilled collar and long sleeves. And it's got with it a lovely pair of frilled panties that have got a bow that's got the um, dragonflies on it, the black dragonflies. Really nice. And because she's three quarter limbs, I've got a pair of white tights and she's got some mustard coloured shoes and I'm going to put a yellow bow in her hair and as I said I sent the male version of this outfit to my friend Gal so I'm hoping that she will dress Liam for us and twin for twinning Tuesday so young lady let's get your shoes off so how are you all doing I hope you're all okay out there and I'm glad you enjoyed my quick video last night. I did want to come on, but had a very busy day, so didn't have a chance really. Let's just pop those there a minute and then I'll get them. Let's just take this little headband off. Yeah, really, really busy day. Here she is, my gorgeous girl. She is so cute. I just love this toddler. I'm so, so pleased to get her. Yeah, bit of a quieter day today. And it's cooled down here considerably, so that's good. Come on, sweetheart. Let's have your arm. There we go. Had a bit of rain in the night, which was nice. And I've been trying to play with Amber today. She keeps going in the play stance. You know how they do, little dogs. But she's not very good with toys. She will chase after her bone if I throw that for her. But she doesn't seem to know what um, balls or anything else are. So there we go, sweetheart. Mummy, take your... There we go. There we go. Lean her up against my beautiful Suzanne Baby's pillow that my dear friend Claudia sent me. I absolutely love that pillow. Yes, yeah, so I've been trying to get her to play a bit. Haven't had any luck yet. But she's really coming on, opening up. She's a really cute little dog. She really is. And she seems to love us all, which is good. Let's take these ones off as well. I don't think you need those underneath, do you? If you're having tights on. Yeah, she loves us all and she settles at night. And, oh, you know, we've just been so lucky with her. There we go, sweetie. Hope you're still seeing her okay. There she is. She's going to look at you all while I put her tights on. Yeah, so we're really, really pleased with her. She's doing amazingly well. And, um, you know, coming out of herself, 
coming out of her shell more and more each day, showing us her personality. She can be quite cheeky. So that's really good. We've got her booked in to be spayed. She's going on the 22nd of September, so a little while to go. But they have to be done three months after their last season, so that's the date she's going in. And I'll tell you more about that when she goes. There we go. Let's get your tights on, sweetie. I'll just pull them up a bit. They always do them too long, don't they? Let's pop these on. I don't know. I think that's supposed to go at the front. So that's what I'm going to do. And pop these on. So yeah, all round, we're really, really pleased with Amber and just hope she gets through the op okay. There we go. Let's get these on, sweetheart. Cute little knickers, aren't they? Pull them up at the back for you, sweetie. Let mummy pull them up at the back. There we go. We've got three rows of frills on them. Really, really nice. Look at that little frilly bum. Little frilly bum bum. Oh, two rows, sorry. Two rows. I thought there were three. There we go, sweetheart. Do you remember when um, tennis players, the lady tennis players, used to wear frilled knickers? <laughs> I was thinking about that the other day, you know, when they used to wear them. Oh, a long time ago that was, wasn't it? Yeah, they used to wear lacy, frilly knickers like you put on babies. There we go. Just undo this. It's got little wooden buttons on it. And I was thinking about, strangely enough, I was thinking about a, a coincidence that happened to me when I was at school. Um, I had this boy who was really interested in me, uh, and his name was Simon, and he asked me to marry him. I know this is kind of going off tennis and everything. Just made me think about it because I was thinking about tennis and we used to play tennis together. Um, and he wanted me to marry him, bless him. I think we were about 10. And um, I told him that I could never marry him because of his surname. Um, <laughs> I didn't like his surname and I, I didn't want to be called Mrs. That, you know. Well, these hands are so hard to get into things. And um, strangely enough, <laughs> that's my husband's surname. So I ended up being Mrs. Anyway. <laughs> uh, what a coincidence is that? Let's turn you around, sweetheart. So yeah, has anything like that ever happened to you? You know, um, I just thought it was funny, you know, that I said no and then married somebody with the same surname. Really silly. She's a little top up, darling. This is such a cute outfit. And I do so love mustard. That's why, you know, when I saw it, I thought I had to send it to Liam because it's such a lovely outfit for a boy as well. So, yeah, very strange coincidence. He was the only boy who was keen on me at school as well. There we go, darling. That looks super cute on her, doesn't it? Super cute on her. Adorable. Let's put your shoes on, darling. Yeah, it's funny, isn't it? 
the things that happen when you're a youngster and that. Let's just lay you down, darling. There we go, so I can get your shoes on. There we go. Cool, I'm doing this thing called Wordle every morning. And this morning, I could not get it at all, the word. Um, I ran out of guesses. I was so annoyed about it. But... And yet, the morning before, I, got, I woke up with a word on my mind and put it in, and it was right. So I got it right the first time. Isn't that weird? There we go, darling. Doesn't that look cute on her? Can't wait to see Liam in his as well. So I hope um, Gal manages to see my my video. Let's just give you a bit of a spray, darling. I'll comb your hair. There we go, sweetie. Got such lovely hair. It's really nice now that my friend Susan put some extra on for her because she was her hair was really thin, but it looks really nice now. And we'll put her little yellow bow in. Should we put it in this side? Oh, it's a bit low, isn't it? That's better. There we go. She's such a pretty girl, isn't she? Look at her. Doesn't that look nice on her? Really, really cute little outfit. Such a sweet little girl. Aren't you? She's one of the Corolla Wedgerich sculpts. I, I'm not sure which one she is, but she's an absolutely gorgeous little girl. Aren't you? And you, yes you, you're nothing but a cheeky little thing. She was up to mischief, this little fairy, isn't she? She's very cute. Very cute little baby. <laughs> My little tiger Lily. I call her Lily. But she's more of a tiger. She's always up to something, aren't you? Always up to something. So, I hope you've enjoyed seeing my gorgeous Francis today. And I hope you have time to twin with a scale. I didn't let you know. I wanted it to be a surprise. So, have a good rest of your day, everybody. And uh, we'll see you again soon. Mwah! Love you, ladies and gentlemen. Mm -hmm.